Hi, it's Dr. David Green, founder and CEO of R3 Stem Cell, the global leader in regenerative therapies. All right, today we're talking about stem cell therapy for liver disease in Mexico. All right, so um, here's your liver. <laughs> this is not life size, this is not an actual liver. It's uh, nice and fluffy, okay? Now, this is the shape of a normal liver. Uh, these are the eyes. <laughs> and the color is usually a lot darker than this all right so this is what a healthy liver you know should look like in a caricature uh, format all right now here's another uh, liver this doesn't have the right shape but what happens is as you develop liver failure the liver starts to get this rough appearance all right and starts to get you know, angry looking. So, what can stem cell therapy do for a liver that has cirrhosis and has affected function, whether it's, you know, stage one all the way down to end stage liver disease? Well, unfortunately, you can't live without a liver. And there really isn't a dialysis type treatment for the liver, right? So, you either have one and you deal with uh, its lack of function, or you get a liver transplant or you know you're not able to live okay so hundreds of millions of people around the globe are dealing with liver failure and two million people die every year um, due to liver failure either not a candidate for a transplant or they're just still on the list and they can't get one all right liver is very important it makes uh, albumin it makes clotting proteins uh, it helps with platelet fun uh, it's a platelet factory um, also, uh, it deals with making bile and metabolizing fats, carbohydrates, proteins. A lot of the medications we take, such as paracetamol, you know, go through the liver. So you really need it, okay? Now, one of the good things about the liver is that, you know, if you take a healthy liver like this and you chop off half of it, you'll probably be fine. I mean, you, it can grow back unlike the other organs in our body. So when you look at uh, why a liver fails, it's usually due to either um, alcoholism, hepatitis, or non-alcoholic fatty liver disease, and then a lot of other less common reasons. But stem cell therapy can work for any of them. We've gotten patients off of a transplant list. We've gotten them um, back uh, as far as uh, their liver function. Uh, doing much better. So I wrote this consumer guide on stem cell therapy for liver disease. We offer this treatment at two locations in Mexico. We are the busiest stem cell clinics in the country. And this treatment is offered via an IV drip. Okay, it's very safe, it's very straightforward. The stem cells will go to the liver. They get attracted by inflammation and the liver has inflammation, you know, especially when it looks like cirrhotic and rough, okay? So, how do they work? All right, so in the consumer guide, I do a summary of all the major studies that have been done around the world over the last couple of decades using stem cells. Now, what's been seen across them is improvements in liver function tests, a decrease of ascites, which is the swelling, improvements in albumin, improvements in the MELD scores, okay, increased platelets, uh, decreased bile, um, bilirubin, sorry, and you know, various other improvements. A lot of the patients that we see um, for liver disease uh, and we do the treatments, not only do they get those improvements, they also get energy that goes way up, their ability to be mentally there with their family and to have substantial conversations and move. You know, a lot of patients with liver disease, they stay in bed all day, they're very tired, they get um, uh, confused, okay, and this helps to improve that substantially. Now, is it a cure for liver disease? No, it's a mitigation, okay, it can help dramatically and it can be repeated with additionally awesome results. Alright, so if you want to look at, to see if you or a loved one is a candidate for stem cell therapy for liver disease, in Mexico, give us a call today at plus one eight four four get stem. Our consultations are free and you'll be able to see if you're a candidate and we can help you. Thank you.